as remote work increases, secure networking solutions are essential. Today, we're going to have a look at Tailscale and we're going to have a look at NetBird and see which one you should be using as your solution. So let's get into it. Jumping straight into Tailscale, uh, Tailscale provides a real user-friendly setup process that can have teams connected within minutes without any complex configurations. Also, it utilizes a zero trust security model to ensure that only authenticated users have access to specific resources, which really does enhance the security. It enables direct peer-to-peer -peer connections between devices, reducing latency and overall improves performance. Also, Tailscale integrates easily with existing VPNs and network infrastructures, providing flexibility for all businesses. It integrates with existing identity providers and security tools, providing a seamless transition for teams of any size. It also includes an intuitive dashboard for network visibility and management, which allows teams to pretty much easily track access as well as performance all in one space. It supports numerous operating systems, including Windows, Mac OS, Linux OS, and Android, ensuring accessibility literally across all devices. One or two of the drawbacks, however, is that it does require a pretty stable internet connection, which may limit its usability in areas with poor connectivity. And also, while it does offer pretty strong fundamentals, uh, you may find that it does lack some of those advanced features if you want to compare it to more complex VPN solutions. Having a look at NetBird here, NetBird is actually open source, which allows you to customize and modify the software according to your specific needs. It's designed for simplicity. So NetBird allows for quick setup and easy management of networks without extensive technical knowledge. It also allows you to access services directly without needing to route through a central server enhancing the speed and the reliability. It also incorporates custom DNS settings, which enables you to configure domain name resolutions based on your specific preferences. It offers features for managing both static as well as dynamic IP addresses, providing versatility for different networking needs, depending on what your needs are. One or two of the drawbacks, however, is that as a new solution, NetBird may not have the same level of community resources or third-party integrations as more established competitors. And then also being an open source tool, dedicated customer support might be less accessible compared to some of the commercially supported services. And that might be a bit of a drawback. Of course, you can see that both of these platforms are fantastic. However, they have been built for specific use cases and specific needs. The key takeaway here should be to go and use both of these platforms to see which one suits your specific needs and which one feels better in a real world scenario. If this was helpful, drop us a like, subscribe to the channel for more awesome content, and we'll see you next time.